Hi ladies, uh, today I would like to share a quick uh, tip how to have instantly more hair um, even different color as long as uh, the root kind of matches your uh, natural hair and you don't need to do any extensions it doesn't damage your hair and it's extremely good for those who have very sensitive scalp I have extremely sensitive scalp so for me uh, to use any kind of like uh, pins or um, hair clips anything actually like creates really bad headache and tension and I cannot wear anything with clips so hair extensions are not for me definitely I was trying to figure out how to have a topper uh, which can stay on your head and no like falling nothing like that so I'm gonna share my secret with you. This is the topper. I ordered it from Etsy or Etsy. <laughs> and um, this is a uh, silky hair. I'm not sure of what type of hair. I mean, it's real human hair, but it's not coarse. It's really nice and silky. And I had it rooted, so it does match my natural hair color here you go um, on the camera it's a little bit like has a different shade but in real life it's exact match uh, for whatever reasons on camera it looks a little bit different but in real life it's like exact match to my real hair so I install it and I have my hair blend in with uh, the hair topper and in such a way like it's literally invisible nobody can tell that it's a hair topper like my husband can tell <laughs> which is good and uh, you instantly have more hair and it's very lightweight it's like super uh, comfortable for summertime uh, especially you know when uh, the sun is really burning and you have really fine hair and you don't want to wear any hats um, for me the sun burns my scalp so bad so this hair topper it's like literally helps me to avoid any kind of uh, sunburn and uh, uncomfortable feeling so this is how it looks and now I'm going to show you how I actually install it so Here you go so it does have this clip which doesn't bother me at all and it has uh, this type of clip this doesn't really bother me that much but I really don't use it it's like it's just there <laughs> unless it's like super super windy outside then yes I use it uh, if it's not windy then I'm not use it and I'm not using it so and uh, how actually it sits really nice you know like when you get a hair topper and you install it and it's kind of like lift it up a little bit so you kind of can see that it's like sticking out and you're like you cannot really like glue it or anything like that so i was wondering what can i do to have the hair topper like instead of like um sitting like that you know when you install the hair topper and it's like kind of sitting like that right so I wanted it to be like that so it's like invisible right so I was wondering what can I do and I came to a solution so I'm gonna show you what I do first of all I take my natural hair and I part it approximately like here like um like that keep this hair over here the same over here kind of to my ear and then the rest of the hair I am gonna put in a little bun so it's out of my way like that and now my secret how I keep the hair topper very comfortable on my head and it's not going anywhere and 
it's secure and it doesn't bother me and doesn't create any headache and it I don't have to use any clips except this little uh, clip but again it's kind of doesn't really bother me and like I said I have extremely extremely sensitive skull so I got this uh, clear elastic I think they use it for jewelry and this is what I did I created some loops with my uh, it was a thread and then I just put elastic through those loops of the thread and I used this little tiny thing to keep uh, elastic together so once you um, measure it around your head you know where to put this little clip I don't know the name of it they sell it in uh, those stores which sell hair extensions and wigs um, so I don't really know how they call those things but anyway now I take the hair topper it faces out of me and I do this so I put it underneath my uh, bun now I take a hair topper and I position it since uh, it's a stretchy uh, elastic I can lift it up kind of like put that comb through and like I said I can use that clip or I don't have to use it if it's windy outside I'm using it if it's not windy outside I'm not using it but just for the video I'll show you that I can use it so I position it in such way that it's like not too close to my um, forehead but uh, kind of has enough uh, hair to blend it in now I take that bun down like that and I blend in like my hair with the hair topper Here, I just take my natural hair and blend in with a hair topper like that and that's it so since um, the hair color matches my root color it's like literally impossible to tell in real life that um, I have a hair topper because it's a silk top hair topper so it has kind of like imitation of um, scalp and when it blends in with my natural hair it's undetectable you can wear it like that or you can have it like that I did a little bit of trimming here to create kind of like a face frame I probably should um, cut a little bit more to have a face frame uh, hairstyle and that's it and then you can also uh, wear it like uh, in a ponytail if you need a ponytail like when it's like windy and it's annoying you you can do that so yes unfortunately <laughs> it like on the video I don't know why it picks up different colors but it's like different colors on the video but anyway you can do ponytail or bun or whatever so and that's it very comfortable nothing pulls my hair no damage that's most important no damage you know how those hair toppers they have clips like here here and here right and you have to clip it into your hair and it does like a um, hair damage no matter what this one doesn't damage hair at all so I'm happy with my solution how I can keep the hair topper secure on my head 
and not having it like lifted like that so because it's on elastic and elastic keeps it securely around my head so I hope it helps somebody and if you need to know more details how I made this please uh, put it in the comments and I will uh, show you step by step how to do it